Hello and welcome back. This is the first video of a series about Sony's DWRS 3 d slot in receiver generation 3. Before we start playing around with the SO 3 d let's talk about some technical facts. First, the SO 3 d is replacing the SO 2 dn in all the other versions Sony has made since 2008. Second, it is fully compatible to all Sony XD camcorders with a slot since 2009. Third, it comes in two different versions with two different adapters. Last point, it is available since April 2020, so you can order it and it will be delivered in a short time. If you look on the technical specs, then we see that the SO3D is coming in two versions. There is an L version, which is for low, is 470 to 640 megahertz bandwidth. And there's an H version, which stays for high, which covers the bandwidth from 566 to 740 megahertz. Of course, it includes all the benefits Sony has implemented in the Arrow 3D 19-inch rack mount receiver third generation. It's the four codecs, the HDR input, X dimension, diversity, cross remote, automatic frequency setup, analog and digital outputs, and a lot of more features. And last, it is very, very light. The weight included in adapter is under 180 grams. On top of the two frequency versions, which covers the ITO region one frequency range complete, we have the ability first time to change the output pin adapter. Standard is the Sony 15 pin. Coming with Sony slot in receivers since more than 20 years, but there is another standard on the market, which is the universal slot, and this has 25 pin. And of course, with the new slot in the version three, you can change this adapter in the way you like, and it will work in any 25 pin universal slot compatible camcorder and third party accessories. So what we have is the DWR-SO3DL for low, is the SO3DH for high, of course, Sony has combined the adapter and the receiver to one product, so you can order the receiver together with the adapter as one product, which named then DWR-SO3DL-S1 for Sony adapter or U1 for universal adapter. And you can buy the adapter as a single product if you later want to change your pin layout. We're coming close to the three minute limit of the videos I like to do, so hands on is in the next video. Thanks for watching. Let's <laughs> go.